you're watching Behind the Brand. When Wrangler decided to give the brand an overhaul, it enlisted young and talented artists to be a part of its creative team. One of them, Marvin Lampano, designer for Wrangler Philippines men's line. I've been with Wrangler since 2008. I witnessed the change in terms of the quality and the service that this company can provide. It's more exclusive and it's more brand focused from tops to bottoms. We have a lot of variety of products to sell and also to offer to the clients in the garment industry. This is the newest player in the garment industry so I'm very privileged and honored to work for the brand. From one artist to another, we checked in with another Wrangler creative department. The people behind making the brand stores a sight to behold. This is the store planning design department. They make sure that they followed our global standard and global look of our boutiques and our department stores. Uh, they also lay out our in-store posters, billboards, and other collaterals of our stores. This is one of our artists doing layout for one of our stores in Makati. The Edge system is Wrangler's global store design concept. The word edge itself defines Wrangler's rugged and edgy lifestyle. We launched this in 2010 and continue to roll out the concept here in our Tainoma store. With young blood making the backbone of the design team for Wrangler, they're quickly resonating with the younger consumers. My merchandising team came out with the best colors and the best designs from each collection. With our fall winter collection, offer a lot of options and new designs which are trendy. It's also a part of reinventing the brand because uh, we are uh, innovating our products for the market specifically here in the Philippines. Right now, we can offer more exciting and more innovative products to continually excite the consumers. But still, we maintain the function and the comfort for people to wear. Tradition says a lot about a brand. It's what keeps its vision in line and in perspective. Wrangler takes pride in keeping true to its principles. The reinvention of Wrangler's image is a global direction that we followed. We get our directions from Europe and Asia-Pacific uh, regional. Such direction gave birth to the unique catwalk at the center of the bustling Mall of Asia atrium, where 12 hours before the show, director Ariel Lozada and models are now rehearsing. So you guys are still just staying here. Tapos kasi isa mo palabas ng mga models dito in sequence. How? Apart from being the third biggest mall in Asia. We chose Mall of Asia Atrium over SMX for the main reason that we want to take advantage of the high foot traffic it generates. This way, we can present our collection to the public, to as much people as we can, and Mall of Asia Atrium also has the space capacity to accommodate our massive stage. People were very impressed with the stage, the huge stage that we put up. This is the first time that a brand has actually done a horizontal setup of the stage facing the highway, facing the globe outside the mall. When we started constructing the stage, there were a lot of people who actually came to look and take pictures of the stage. Wrangler Philippine stage design is truly a one-of-a-kind catwalk. And who better to make their first step on the runway than the models themselves, who despite the early call time, strut their stuff with smiles on their beautiful faces. Our three supermodels show us why they are once and for all called supermodels. But of course, no one probably does the walk better than director Ariel Lazada, who shows our models the real deal. With the stage all set and the models ready, it's only a matter of time before we become witness to the first ever Wrangler fashion show in the Philippines. Coming up next, as the show gets closer, excitement becomes unbearable. The team polishes some last-minute preparations for the most awaited event of the evening, Wrangler at Philippine Fashion Week.